Good morning and welcome to TCTC Time, everybody. I'm your host, Michael McKenzie, and today we're going to be talking about Capstone with Mrs. Wright. Hashtag CapSnap. Good morning, students. Today I'd like to cover, you know, a lot of information that most students have questions about. Um, and I'm really sure that most of you guys have this project done, right, Michael? Oh, totally. Totally done. So I'm going to go over some questions that students have had and give you some updates on the fourth checkpoint that's coming. So let's head over here to the iPad. Okay. Uh, just kind of a reminder that all the information that any students will need is located. Attention juniors, if you have completed an intent to participate form for YSU and Kent College Credit Plus, please report to McLean <laughs> Lecture Hall A at this time. Thank you. All right, great announcement. Here we go. So all students have this TCTC capstone app here and what I want to do to start is talk about the project timeline where are we and where are we headed so um, it is the March April section program teachers will be covering the career development section with you in the next month in early April all English teachers will talk about defense day uh, what to wear how to uh, how to do the speech and then defense day this year is April 26th so the next thing I want to talk about is what actually goes on that career development page on the capstone page in requirements and examples you can click project requirements and see what goes on any page but today we're going to talk about the career development page most students will put their resume on there uh, any community service competitions gpa attendance anything that kind of has helped advance their career so what i would like to do is show you guys some examples remember on the capstone app in the requirement and examples section you can see all kinds of student examples. Today we're going to take a look at Michaela's example and her career development page. So here's what she has on there. She has examples of where she job shadowed. She has jobs outside of school. This does not have to be significant. This is simply a job at Cockeye Barbecue, um, but showing that she's pursuing her E. Community service. She also volunteered at the Warren Mission and then her report card. Here's what I want to mention about the report card. Um, it doesn't all have to be a and A's and B's. Even if you were, um, you know, if you increased your grades when you came to TCTC and you have better grades here, it's okay to show that you've grown. And the last thing could be your resume. Um, one other example I would like to show you guys, this is Jeff. He is currently in uh, construction. If you have any awards from your home school or outside competition skills, any of those things can go there. One last thing I would like to mention if you've been absent for any of the checkpoints in the section called how to videos every checkpoint is there so you can see all the videos on how to build the page and add to each one and finally all the defense information that you will need is in the defense day section so hey you know what i, I wonder what a presentation looks like well you could watch it happen i wonder what the speech outline looks like what's the schedule going to be how are the judges going to grade me all that information is here and broken down by section your English teachers will cover this with you in the near future, but if you're interested in getting a head start, you can go ahead and do that. So remember, all this information is on your app, the, the TCTC app. And one final thing, seniors, please remember, in order to get a completion certificate from TCTC, you must complete Capstone. It is a graduation requirement. Okay, I think that's all I have for you guys. If you guys have any questions, remember you can email me at any time, or you can find me in the cafeteria. All right. Thank you for watching TCTC Time, everybody, and I'll see you this Thursday.